In Cleveland tonight, a march and a rally in memory of George Floyd is taking place right now. 3 News' Will Uick is there where dozens of people have come out for a peaceful demonstration. Hi, Will. Yeah, Laura, good evening to you. You're right. We're here on the east side of Cleveland. Behind me, you can see this march that's going on. This started at the Thurgood Marshall Recreation Center and was organized by Ward 7 Councilman Bashir, and he wanted people to come out, cops. He wanted councilmen to come out. He wanted activists to come out, and they all did. It was really a, a sight in the beginning when everybody was gathering, making their signs, gathering to basically put a vigil on for George Floyd, but also call for solidarity as they walk down the street from the recreation center. They're headed out toward Lead Park. And I spoke with a police officer before this all began about why it's so important for the two to come together in a show of solidarity like this. We have our authority by the consent of the community. And if there's a problem with the community, if they feel like their departments, their divisions are not serving them, they have every right in the world to speak out about it. Start on that. So, as I said, uh, Ward 7 Councilman Bashir Jones, as well as Police Chief Calvin Williams, other members of the police force, as well as activists, community members, even Congresswoman Marsha Fudge, all exposed to be in attendance here as they march from Thurgood Marshall Recreation Center down to League Park as a vigil for George Floyd, but also a sign of solidarity, a call for peace. We'll have much more of this coming up tonight at 11, guys. A lot of people there showing support. Will Uick, thank you so much.